Hey guys, and welcome back for more Tharsis action. We did missions the last three episodes, taking care and tackling and being victorious on all five of them that are available right now. Let's get back into it. I believe we're on a one game winning streak here. I think I had a, a total dis a loss, a total disaster, and then the uh, the salty run back that landed my pilot on the Mars. Almost said the moon. Oops, let's not hit missions. Let's hit new game. Uh, yeah, my pilot had one death, one one um, victory. Psychologist has one victory, no deaths. So he's like the best ever. Joy Lee's at, uh, at about... I don't know what that would be. 50% chance of success? No, not really, because that's that's 4 out of 6. So 66 cents, uh, percent chance. Doing good all overall. Our doctor was terrible. So it looks like we're better off without our doctor. And we're a long way away still. Still over like 50%. Um, less than 50% completed on this achievement to get Sofia Diaz. So we'll just assemble a crew and, and tackle it. A couple things I do want to take care of if I can. That will break any winning streak. Uh, one, we want to survive about 9 damage in one turn. Two, we want to play a few rounds with only one crew member. And then three, we want to eat as many human human meals as possible to unlock Sofia Diaz. If any of these opportunities come up, I'm going to break the streak just to tackle them. But we're not going to play just for them. And I'm not too sure how I would play just for them. I mean, the nine damage impending, uh, we might be able to handle that and survive. But other than that, I think I'm going to have to devise a way to play specifically to, to tackle those achievements. So what do we want here? Well, we found that we're fine without Gene and Kayla. I like Allison's rerolls. I like Joy's assists. I like Nikki's repairs. Pascal's good for that emergency ship HP. If we mishandle things and our impending damage equals our ship health. That'd be nice. John Park is uh, undefeated. His stress, you know, if we can send them into low, low damaged um, events, and utilize his extra dice towards research projects and stress management, that seems nice too. Yuri's ignore movement damage. I, I underestimated that. I did like that, but in the end, there should be a, oh, there is a random button. I was gonna say there should be a random button, but uh, I didn't look at all the buttons. There was four, four buttons in my defense. I didn't really have the time to look at them all. But there is a random button. We'll get to that as soon as we unlock Sofia Diaz and we, we're all set with our achievements. We'll just start doing random runs. Ah, stress. Here we go. Here we go. Starts three people off in the same spot. 27. 27 minus one health all. How are we doing here? Four dice, three dice. Okay, we're, we're averaging 3.33 dice. Less than that. Oh, our health is terrible, too. And this is a 9, huh? I feel like I want to take Allison here. With two dice... And many rerolls. If I stay away from the 1, I should be able to tackle this. And then I can just kind of... Um, get John and Nikki health and dice. And then Joy could just... Uh, I don't know. Chip away at this. Allison might be better off getting dice, though. Nikki might be better off here, because any one is a four. Two ones is still a disaster, but any one is a four. And we can we can give her food, we can bring her to four dice next turn. Let's do that. Well, there's nine. So, done. Her specialist ability and that module specialist ability were like, you know, non-factors. Allison is the person I'd like to give dice to. Doubles brings her to full dice next turn. So. Let's get doubles. Those are doubles. And we are at full dice for next turn. Good. Now, John's just going to get health. Might have wanted to roll him last, though. 
to reduce stress in case uh, we get stress in that other terminal. All right. Well, he absolutely needs the health. We can manage the stress another turn. In fact, we can get minus 10% stress now for all crew members, but we'll just bank the dice. That energy boost might be uh, might be helpful. All right, one assist. Assists I don't really care about on stasis dice. Uh, any duplicate ones that get put into stasis, I can just uh, put into ship repair here. So we used one assist. We'll bank the six, bank the five, re-roll the rest. Sounds good. Three and a five, all right. Can't put the three in research projects. Probably don't want to put the five in research projects. We can put the two fives into ship repair and then knock this down to 18 for the next turn. Or we can just knock it down to eight. Or we can knock it down 14 and have full assists for next turn in case we get void and stuff. All right, we'll do that. We can always come back in here and get more ship repair at a later date, but it's nice to start off with the, those assists. It's just that's just angry Larry thinking, angry Larry logic. It's uh, something that we're going to trademark eventually. One food minus one dice for you guys. Joy can then eat said food and go to. We can have nine dice between the two instead of eight dice between the two. Oh, well, actually, the dice, the the food can come over here. Do I start with one food or two? One. Plus two assists, minus one ship. Well, that's not even an option. I mean, it is an option, but we're already full on assists, so. Let's just do that. Now, Nikki only has one HP. Do I take the chance that she rolls two dice, one die twice and gets a five or a better? And I can always use that card to give her more dice. That doesn't sound logical, but that doesn't sound logical. But she's gonna do it because Nikki, Nikki's a trooper here. I don't like the fact that there's an event in there though. So we're probably gonna use her last. All right, Joy's already stuck back here. It's minus one health wall everywhere. If I don't get rid of them all, Nikki dies. In fact, Nikki's going to die. I can't get Nikki into the medical bay without dying right now. So Joy is probably going to have to lose HP to, to move out and uh, roll in one of these terminals. We have three assists and everyone's going to take damage if they move and Nikki into here and Nikki can't roll move into there. But I'd much rather take the one damage and roll with three assists to get rid of this. I mean, what bad numbers, right? What bad numbers? Man, I got 12. At 12. Maybe I can get a 7 card. No, 7 card wouldn't, wouldn't do me any good because I'd have to bank research projects to get it. I don't like these options anyway. They're not good for us this time around. No movement damage. I guess I can use. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Honestly, let me take one more second here. I think we just put 14 into this and then explore options. And this also puts Allison in the state where she's going to die too. So we absolutely have to get rid of all these. Have to. Absolutely have to get rid of them all. We have markers up top now. I didn't even notice that until I just went into this module. All right, well, you got rid of this. Perfect. And I can bank these two as well. 
And regaining dice on you is not important as re-rolling and maybe getting a card that bails us out. If, in fact, Joy cannot take care of this. And remember, Nikki still needs to get a 5 to take care of this. I would say a 3 and she's dead, but a 3 and, uh... Yeah, 3 and she's dead. Everyone else would live live on. What do we have here? What are these triangles? Oh, this is the... Imp okay. This was in the patch notes. We're going to see in advance how many events we get a week before we get them. So we had two events the first week, two events this week. I don't know what, what yellow... Yellow might be with injury dice. Oh, you know what? They might be with... Um, might have to do with the, the number it takes to repair. I don't know. Because they're both minus health all. One has stasis die, one has injury die. Maybe yellow is two dice, red is three dice, and green is one die for the, uh, the hazards. I don't know. We'll find out next turn. Because we're going to get three events. Alright, Joy. Let's go. You got to take care of this. Do it up. And you did it up. It becomes that thing where, in what order do I want to do this? Well, I need three dice to take care of it, no matter what. And I need doubles for ship repair. But assists are useful for Nikki right now. So, take care of this event. And I can get the assist with the card, but Nikki needs to roll a five. I need, like, a dice card here. Duct tape might be good. Duct tape's very good, because anything she rolls will go towards the four. You know, for her specialty, we'll repair it four, and then uh, duct tape will just take care of the rest. The thing is, do I give her assist now? No, I don't. I give her... I give ship HP. I give her health. So that her one die will not kill her. And anything she rolls... It's a four. <laughs> so, so thanks for the four. But, you know, could have been a three, I guess. Did that. I don't know. How do you think I did on that one? I got, I got to throw it. You know, did I run 70 yards for a 20 yard gain? Or did I uh, handle it pretty well? I don't know. I think I've handled it well. Minus 30% stress for all. Minus one ship HP. We can afford that. Or minus 30% stress for you guys. Let's just do all. Yeah. No food. Nikki's still in trouble. Alright. So we just had three events drop on our head. Green, green, red. We have two dice. Hazard dice and all. They're both different types of hazard dice. One's health, one's food, one's dice. So the number, the, the, the triangles must indicate how much it needs to be repaired. With green being maybe like 12 and under, yellow being 18 and under, and red being 24 and under, or, or plus 19, 19 plus. That sounds legit in my mind. Nikki and Allison need health. Nikki needs dice. The ship doesn't need HP, and our cards are miserable for what we're going through right now. John has the most dice. Maybe John rolls the void with the void dice here. And enjoy rolls for, for this. We absolutely have to take care of this. We can suffer minus one dice all. We can suffer minus one food, except people have to move out of this area and through this area. So we might as well take care of it. I mean, John can come back here for Joy to move up. Eh, you know? Let me stick Allison here. It's double health, health though. 
So we do this. Allison here first, Joy here second, bank assists to move John here, and then we do with whatever with uh, with Nikki. There's our seven. So we cannot harvest food, but maybe we want to get a higher number here for the research project. So just put in the one <laughs> and uh, re-roll the damn cards. Because it doesn't matter what number we put in there if we re-roll the card. Actually, it does matter. We can re-roll at a later date. Ah, choose. Uh, maybe I should just re-roll the cards now. This way I know what I'm aiming for. One food, one die all crew, which is good. 17 module repair, it's good. Ah, uh, for here. If I can get it. Alright. I said I wanted to do Joy next, because I want assists. I, I, you know, we roll twos on this, uh, on this channel. We've said this before. I was just about to compliment the fact that at least a uh, two is not a stasis die. And then I roll four twos. Certainly boosts us in ship repair, but does nothing for us anywhere else. Alright, well there's our five. Now, here's the thing. We can take care of this now. Or I could just start banking dice, banking ship HP. Someone else has to come in here anyway. We need the assist that's double injury dice for Pascal. We can bank the four and then take ship HP and not have to worry about ship HP ever again, probably. We did nothing in this terminal, by the way. We just farmed. And that's fine. Now, John has the most health. So, John needs to to take care of this. Any one, two, or three, though, the six will equal 17 in the repair. Because of the card. But if we don't take care of this, Allison and Nikki die. At the very least, we have to make sure that we hit four or under. So that any roll for Nikki that's not a three. Because <laughs> that would kill her. We'll, uh, we'll end it. But we need to take care of this. So we need high numbers. One assist. One assist and low numbers. But that's four plus 17. That's what, 21? And then I send Nikki in here. Ugh. God. That's miserable. But we do have one assist. So that's the saving grace here. We are going to get out of this. 17 and 4 is 21. Finish deployment. Leave the last assist. That's why we're not re-rolling. Because anything Nikki rolls clears this terminal. To 2. She cleared it. Now everyone loses a dice next turn. A die next turn. And we have two medium events coming up. Minus 30% stress for all. Minus one ship. Plus two health for you. Minus one dice. I mean, listen. The minus one dice is really not that far stretched. But let's just do that. And then we just, uh, we jack. Everyone has no stress, so let's just jack up the stress. On everyone. Who do we want this on? Probably better for Joy than John. And finish. So medium between 13 and 18 seems to be right. Uh, looks like I nailed the color-coded uh, triangles down. Because we have two moderate things here. Who needs dice? Who needs what? Again, it's not affecting ship HP. We're just getting health and dice events. The dice is making us miserable, though. And the minus one health all is not going to kill anybody right now. Let's... Well, we can't handle everything. Because because John only has two dice. So he can't handle a terminal on his own. Unless it's this one. And uh, it's not going to be that one. Could be that one, but it's not going to be. 
Two sixes, I don't trust him. I was gonna say Allison could could roll for food. Plus one assist, plus one food, plus one die all crew. I'm gonna roll with Nikki first, and this could kill her. Can't kill her. If she rolls three twos, then we just uh, eject from the uh, module. But we like our twos, so at least one of them is gonna show up. That's only a 10. I need to re-roll these, not roll double twos, and have one of the dies be a six. Okay, well that was miserable. I'm not happy. I'm not happy about what I just did. All right. <laughs> Minus one health all is going to kill nobody. Minus one dice all is going to crush everybody. We have to get rid of this. Why was I not getting rid of this? Good. Always one, two. Always. I mean, if I banked anything with her before, with uh, Nikki before, not banked anything, but put anything up here, that we would have been out of this. I mean, the minus one dice is going to kill us, but I can't risk losing anybody. That's where it all starts to snowball. You lose one person and you're virtually done in this game. So now John can come in there, roll two ones, get him stuck in stasis, and we'll, we'll clear this terminal. Yeah. Don't roll two ones, dude. Five and a one's good. Because the five will clear the terminal, and the one will give you two dice of which you lose one. Now, my goal here with Joy is to... Let's see what's going to happen next turn. Allison's going to go to one die. If, if Joy clears this, best case scenario. Nikki to three, John to two, Allison to one, Joy to three. All right, so Joy has to clear this and put one unique die down in the research area. And at least give us one food for next turn. I said one unique die, but I guess that's fine because minimal amount of dice to, to defeat the repair. Bank the food and store the one because it was in stasis. I couldn't re-roll it. All right, well, minus one die all. I mean, what am I going to do? Plus two health for all crew minus two ship. That's like a huge option right now. I don't want to lose any more dice. So let's not have to worry about health in doing that. And who stands to do better with the dice? Well, John has the most health. So he'll be the bravest to tackle anything that has a uh, injury dice. We get one small and one large event, though. So dice spread out could be better. Made no sense at all, but I did it. Oh, three injury dice. What was I just saying about injury dice? Now ship HP becomes a thing. And so does assists. 
Look at look at next next week. Two high rolls and one medium roll. So we're gonna get three events on top of everything next time. I don't feel safe, is what I what I'm saying. Minus one food, I'm gonna ignore you. We, we don't have food. We're never gonna have food. We can go plus one health all crew if things get weird. We have two people at max HP. We can add an assist, so let's let's add an assist. At least. And let's let Nikki chip away at this and then Joy to follow. With the assists and the plus four to repair. I'm okay rolling once in here. Follow with Joy. Hope to clear it and add more assists by way of the module. Or I do the reverse. I do Joy first. Use assists, add assists. And then Nikki's free to take limited health. John can roll for dice, and Allison can roll to get rid of this. Minus one dice all? Yeah, I guess so. Let's go. Of course. Of course, Joy only has two dice. So let's, uh... Let's bring that to, uh... To someone's attention. Oh, look. Nikki's not gonna die if she rolls in here. Yeah, Nikki's not gonna die if she rolls in here. And any three unique numbers, and we can add health. I mean, we actually want her to get injured, because that just means that we're actually rolling and gonna complete this. But this is an absolute... We have to get rid of this. I can roll that two again. I can roll that two again. But if I get any number I want to get, she's gonna take another injury. So let's just let's just clear it. Not do more harm than good, you know? Now Allison takes care of that fifteen, huh? And then John rolls for dice. Worst case scenario, John comes down here and finishes it off and our life is hell next turn. That's 13. That's 13 and two dice are in stasis. I cannot complete this by myself. Shocker, right? This one's miserable. All right. <laughs> Three. We're going to be overwhelmed next turn. I mean, probably should have just rolled in ship HP and just hope for the best. Everyone loses a die. Well, he's only got two dice, so everyone loses a die. He's going to go to one die. Everyone loses a die. Allison will be at two. Everyone else will be at one. One, one, two, three. Or if he goes here, he's three. Allison is two. Joy's one. Nikki's one. I don't know. I'm not happy, to say the least. Six and a two. Oh, okay. I mean, you know I'm going to roll a one here. Two. I'm going to roll a two again. So, get the repair. Put the two down here. Man, that was... Uh, I haven't been making the most of my rolls here. I haven't been able to, to do that. That suit. Plus one dice for you guys. Minus two ship. No, I don't think I want to do that with three events on the horizon. Plus one food, minus di one dice for you guys? Yeah. I'm going to get more dice overall. So.
See, I'm going to give it to Nikki, but Nikki has, like, the lowest health. Now, all of a sudden, I'm not comfortable doing that. I did it last turn. John has the most health. So he can stand and run through modules, take damage, and then take on higher numbers, and we're going to get two of them. At least that are going to be 19 plus. Okay. Six impending damage. Well, if John takes care of that large fire, like, everyone needs to take care of that 15. Uh, we might die this turn. Five dies for 15. John absolutely has to take care of this by himself. And he only has one assist. And he le needs large numbers, so he's probably going to take a lot of damage to clear this. One five, huh? That doesn't do it. That's just 13, and there's nothing down there. I don't want to re-roll cards. Probably better off re-rolling cards. Any six. Well, three sixes and we die. But, like, we needed a better roll than that, though, let's be honest. This has been miserable. This round. Seven. Eleven. Sixteen. Seventeen. No, can't do it. All right. Someone else has to come in here. That plus one ship might be huge, though. I'd really rather save Allison, because we might need to roll doubles. Everyone else is up here anyway. And, like... Nobody has the dice to do anything. So both of them need the roll here. That gives it the four impending damage. And then Allison needs to roll here and either clear this with three dice, and that's a miracle, or roll doubles. And then we probably die next turn. Yeah, one. One's pretty good. Good good roll. Oh, let's get a one again. Okay, well, that's at least a four. And now Joy has to roll at least a four. <laughs> it's just... Oh, thank God. Thank God. All right, Allison, this is on you. Doubles or three dice totaling 15, go. It's a free, I guess it's a free roll, because if, you know, if I get a 1, I get one more ship HP, and everything else can get put down into research projects anyway. 4. 4 is probably better than what I had. I probably had a 4. I don't even remember. But this is not good. Hopefully some good events here. Like plus 5 dice for all would be nice. I don't think that exists. Plus 1 ship, minus 1 health. Plus one food? Yeah, food. Food over stress. Don't care. I guess Joy gets... I still want to give it to Nikki, because Nikki has the ability... Like, four damage minimum. We might need assists, though. And Joy has the most health, other than John. Allison has the rerolls, though, but... I'd rather not have one person... Two people at one die... We have seven impending damage here, though. We can probably take care of five of them. And that doesn't leave us with enough uh, ship HP. So 
So to think about things here, I can move Allison into here. But she needs a perfect roll to take care of this. Joyce probably got a roll up here, but a perfect roll is 24. John rolls down here. Perfect roll is 18. Nikki just cleans up wherever, and she's going to probably have to clean up between the three. And then just to die next turn anyway. So we were pretty much dragging this on to die. But I really want to pull out of it. And who would think, like, for, for a round that consisted of no, like, ship damage for, like, the first four weeks or whatever it was, that we'd be in this big of trouble. Well, Allison first... And then move John into here. And then Joy and Nikki stay up here. I would need doubles here, though. And then on three dice, need a total of 15. We need at least one doubles. And to take care of both of these. I think moving John here is the option. I mean, we need a card that gives us uh, repairs. But I'm holding on to the hope that this pulls us out of it. I don't know. This doesn't look good. Uh, let's try it. John first. Doubles and a six. Or how about just a six and a five then? Allison had two dice, right? Yeah, she did. I was hoping that that gave us a card. A good, uh, like, it gave us a card, obviously, but I was hoping that gave us a card that was plus ship HP or... or something. So if we take care of this, then we have to blindly add a die there to which Nikki has to match. Because Nikki can't move into here. Well, she can move into here. But then she can't roll a one. Nope, that's not true. Uh, Alright, so, so the dumbest of all plays here. Nikki's going to roll in here. Any roll and she, she beats it. Finish deployment. I mean, that means <laughs> we need a perfect roll on Joy to, to, to finish up here, which we're not going to get. But if I can roll triples with Joy, I'll get three ship HP. And then Allison takes care of this. <laughs> With, with a perfect roll. So we need a perfect roll with four dice or a perfect roll with two dice. Just to last one more one more week. I don't think it's doable. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're done. I mean, do I want to... Guess I'll just roll this first. Doubles. Nope. Doubles. Nope. And doubles. Nope. Well, we bank them. We finish deployment. We bring Joy here. Deploy. Uh, one assist, so I'm thinking one roll. I just... We just just hit everything on stasis so let's uh, use the three 
and re-roll our cards. 17 to one repair. It's uh, laughable. Because we can't back that up. All right, we're done. Uh, we're done. Plus three, plus three to ship. Plus three to ship is also pretty funny. Uh, let's do plus three to ship, just because the uh, the irony there. And, uh, that went pretty bad. But what was I gonna do? I really don't feel like uh, like I'm on the I'm on the side of saying that like your actions dictate your luck in this game. But our luck was pretty good to start. We didn't get a lot of stuff that damaged our ship. And then when we got the stuff to damage our ship, like, we just didn't handle having dice on people uh, well, you know, for, for the lack of a better uh, better structured sentence. We, uh, we just didn't have dice on people. And uh, I never regained the dice. Didn't farm for dice or anything. And then eventually we got all those uh, events that, cause ship damage and we couldn't keep up but but that's uh that's Tharsis baby and uh thanks for joining me if you did somehow enjoy this video please consider leaving a like and check out my other videos on YouTube subscribe to the channel for more we update regularly other gameplay for other games new games always coming in pretty uh, coming in soon edit all the time I should say check me out on Twitch twitch.tv slash angry Larry and on Twitter at Larry is angry and until I play again I guess I'll see you guys next time later.